Hey guys, my name is Sidiac and welcome back to another episode of Airport CEO. Well, last episode, guys, we worked on our brand new kind of frontage to the airport. We built our very own uh, brand new kind of underground car parking area, which gives us so much room for activities <laughs> uh, so to speak which is uh, really cool because now we've got a huge underground parking it frees up all this stuff right now uh, above ground that we can kind of play around with and do stuff with and we've got a really cool little entrance and exit point too I'm really happy with how this has now kind of turned out. So today I want to try and focus on um, getting this little one set up here, this little kind of sticky outlet, because it will mean we'll have then a free additional large aircraft that can pretty much come into it. And um, what does it sense here? Allow medium. So we, we could potentially allow medium aircraft on these ones as well. Maybe that's something that we should think about doing. So now I want to try and extend it a little bit further along and see what we could possibly get in. I don't know if there's going to be enough room for something else. I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out. But it's going to be pretty cool. I, I still need to get all the insides done too. I'm, I've been putting it off for so freaking long. But by getting these ones in, it means we have to connect it to the additional baggage claim area. Um, baggage what they called baggage handling systems is that what? baggage bays there we go that means we also have to then build more baggage claim areas so adding these on means you have to do a little bit more work inside but hopefully it brings in more people and we can make some more of that sweet cash money moolah so unfortunately we spent loads of money last episode you know it's going to happen. And we're probably going to do the same today as well. So we won't be making any profit for quite some time as we now spend millions on getting things all set up. So first things first, and I need to kind of move the air traffic control tower. That kind of needs to get slightly out of the way. And I can then um, delete this one because I need the room to kind of add the extra stand in. And this fits in quite wonderfully here. So I'm going to drop it there. Genius. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed Airport CEO, then please make sure you smash that like button down below. If you are new on here too, guys, please make sure you subscribe because we've got some sweet, sweet, sweet expansions coming up very soon and you're not going to want to miss it. So let's put that into fast forward then. And while that kind of happens, we're going to build the rest of the terminal. So where's it go? It goes up to there, straight to there. Easy peasy, a love it, squeezy. And we just make sure we get delete that wall because we don't need it. Glorious. Glorious! Uh, right, we also need to delete this wall. Delete this wall. And delete this wall. And I suppose we have to delete... Well, a lot of it, really, aren't we? So I kind of wanted to extend over a little bit. But we'll do it in stages, because our workforce, as good as they are, you know, they can only go so fast. <laughs> so fast. Uh, right, so what else do we need to do then? So I know we have these little check-in desks here. Is it these ones? We have like an extra one. It's these four, isn't it? Yeah. Hold on. Hold on. If I can click it, yeah. They're connected up individually, which is pretty good. Um, i got to wait for them to build that before I can delete this one. So it's all based on once they finish building what they're building, I can then make some more sweet pr progression. Ooh, we're down to the five millions. Remember that. Because we're spending so much money. Look at that. We've spent like an extra 700,000 just on the stuff that we're dropping in right now. It is kind of crazy. And it's kind of crazy, but it's going to be totally worth it in the end. Yes. <laughs> uh, right. Anyway, I've, are they going to get this terminal here thingy done before the, the air traffic control tower? They might just. No, actually, no, because there's a lot of wall they've got to place in. Uh, I'm just waiting now for that. That's now built. So. Bulldoze, you get out of here. Right, and with that done, once that's deleted, I can then get my large stand in. Let's just rotate that. But again, I gotta wait for. The oh, there we go. Goes there. Just gotta wait for the air traffic control tower to be removed. And we actually made some sweet progression already. Where's their little uh, progression arrows? Okay, they've still got quite a while to go. You won't realize how long it takes. But we get this in. We then connect this to the road. So we've got that round loop, which is really nice. There we go. And then the road, which the road falls under a service road, which just goes to there. And I don't know if we're going to need a tunnel there at some point, but I'm going to build a tunnel, tunnel just in case. What's it like underneath? Because I could have like this go. Oh, this road here. Oh! 
Boys. Is that service road? Yeah. Don't tell me. That's perfect. So a lot of people can just come under the tunnel there, just drive straight up and then go straight across. If needs be. That's amazing, boys. That's amazing. Right, okay, so they're getting all that built. Good stuff. I need to get some... So there will be. I need to get some more baggage claiming bays up and running before I go any further. So... We've got all this set up here. I gotta try and do the right space and stuff like that. So seating, you need a double row. So we do one more double row, right? Is it after a two? Um, yeah, we do it after a two. Because there's an awkward space there because it's not quite the same spacing. If that makes sense. Slightly awkward, but we get it. You know, we just had to pretend that never existed. And then we need to get the conveyor belt systems, which we need the high speed one, which that is then only one gap over. But if I start that here, and that goes down to there, which oh, we needed to actually delete that. I forgot the turn. I forgot we got to do a kind of turn on it. So that goes across by here. So that will go up there. All right, that is then my baggage claim. So really, what? We, oh, did I get that one in? If you think about it, I gotta get that one there as well. If you think about it right, it's two stands to a baggage claim. So one, so it's like I got four there. So that's one, two, three, four. Now we five and six. So I've got to do another one here. So then I did like a, a four gap, didn't I? Which is this. All right, I'm trying to get my bearings to how I did this. There we go. That's the extra one. Now I've thrown in. So we'll get some more seating in. Because we're good boys like that. And then it's the half seating that we got going through the rest of it. So how is that done? So it, it's done... One just after. No, it's, it's a two gap. So I'll just keep it rocking and rolling and moving. How did I start it there? Two away, which is there. And obviously, the two gap. Wow, how did that mess up? A little bit of lag there. Cost me the seating. Right, throw that in. So then I've just got to put. Now, the conveyor belt system um, going, going up, but it goes up from that way. Okay, guys, remember this. <laughs> it's important. Right, okay, so up. So our first one's there. Let me just watch where it's going. It's going there. Yep. Next one's there. Boom. Yep. Yeah. And then my next issue is, let's put it back into fast forward then. If I go down, is it comes around here and I'm going to make it go under the ground for the road section. <sighs> this is always fun. It's always fun. So convey about again, the high speed. Then goes here. We want it to go down. So it's not there. It's here. But how far do I want it to go down? So if I make it go there, back up. So hold on. Oh no, it's an up one I want. Yeah, it would go like that, wouldn't it? And they will be, yes, there. Connected. <laughs> right? Oh, I don't know if that's going to work. I think it's the wrong way round. Right, where's my high-speed baggage? And that would obviously go out this way and then connect up to those. But hold on, because I feel like this... Yeah, the arrow's going the wrong way. So let me delete you. And then we go down. It's just easier to do it this way. So convey about... Going up. Like that. Glorious. That is now done. Right, sweet. So we just needed the tilt trays on. So back to the high-speed baggage claim 
thingamajig. One there. One there, and obviously we'll go that way. Turn that straight down, that straight down. And it's just a tilt trace. Boom, boom. And then that would be all then technically connected. There's that random one just here, which no longer need. That's all then connected to the, the baggage claim area when they get off. Wait, is that one slightly bigger? What's going on here? And my spacing. Which is the right size one? Huh? <laughs> so why is this across? That is... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ah, oh, that one's slightly bigger than all the rest. Seniac, what's throwing me off about that? I, I mean, it's the grid because I was basing it off the grid pattern. Right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fix it, but it means I'm gonna have that extra gap. Spacing. Oh, we, actually, you might be able to fix out my chair situation. Wouldn't it? Right, delete this, this, and this. Because i got to move it all back over by one. I'm just not 100% sure on how I'm going to move it all back over by one. So that would go straight down. Oh, I don't actually need to delete this one. Which is fine. I mean, this is the worst thing in this game that I don't like doing. Pause, because that can stay. Well, I'm hoping it can stay. It might have to be deleted. Do you know what? It has to be deleted. I mean, this is the, the biggest thing I, I hate about this game is doing the baggage stuff. So annoying. Which means i got to delete all this. i delete it up to there. All right, get it all out, boys. Get it all out. And do you know what, as well? We'll delete all these chairs. Because I'll replace them down and I'll get a better spacing in them. And these ones are going to be off-centered as well. Some of these. Get rid of them all and I'll redo it, guys. Thank you. Appreciate y'all. Right, we go down then. So back to the baggage then. Where is it? My tilt tray needs to go here. My high speed, when I can select it, goes there. And then going, high speed going up. There we go. Genius. Right, finally, that's all now up and running. A contract was completed successfully. We got a bonus. I take it was this one. Yes. Right, let's go for, let's go for Valentino. There we go. They want 5,700. 5, oh, what? <laughs> right, we're going to complete that one as well. It's easy money this is at the moment. Easy money. Okay, back to the seat in then. Now I can get this in. So if I do a... By two. By two. Right, we do a two by two by two there. Easy enough. Right, there we go. That one there, 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 there. See, it's spaced a lot better now, isn't it? Even though we got that one extra. But that's okay. Because I can place seating like this. Just on this side. That becomes like a walkway. In its own right. Oh, I can get a chair there as well. Right, we're rolling with that. That is now all good. Let me just double check that underground. It's all connected. Yeah. So we're, we're ready then to rock and roll and set these guys up then. So we're going to allow medium aircraft on these ones. Because that will uh, slightly, slightly spice things up. In a way that it will satisfy the aircraft satisfaction a little bit more. Because now we're choosing or we're allowing medium aircraft to come on these ones. Granted, when a medium one comes, you don't get as many passengers or make as much money. But the satisfaction's there. We're, we're, um, what's the word we're looking for? We're kind of like, sat, well, we, what's the word I'm looking for? We're like doing it for a wider audience. 
catering for a bigger demographic, if that makes sense. I think that's the word I'm trying to look for. I don't even know anymore. What's real life? Well, let's sort the taxi pathway out for these. Uh, there we go. That's all connected. I need the one for the middle of this. Nice. Okay, right. Sweet, 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 sweet. Wait, looking at it. That goes over by two. That one goes over by three. That's weird how it does that. But it doesn't do it to them. Uh, must be built a taxiway foundation. What? Is that now all done? Um, okay, we need to get into the security desk and stuff like that then. That's our next big thing. So, desks, information, check-in desk, boarding desk. And i got to figure all this out again right now. So, green facing goes that way. And we've done it one above, one above of a free gap, if that makes sense. Wait, wait, one above what? The door? We don't even make the door. No, it's in line with this. Oh, can't do it because it needs to be in a secure zone. Whoopsie. It's like, whoopsie, I made an oopsie. Right, you're all in. Desks. Medium. So, three across goes to there. Wait, we don't have... Oh, um, come on, said Yuck. I was wondering where the other one was there for a second. There we go. There we go. So they're all there, then. We've just got to connect those guys up. So what's missing now, then? A boarding desk and a baggage bay. So let's connect the baggage bay up first, then. We'll do it for these ones, then. So this will be this one here. To there. These ones will be this one. And this one. We'll turn these on. But obviously they won't work just yet. Because then we need to get from the checking desks. That one's connected to there. That one's not. So one there. One there. Then this one. One there. And one there. So what's their issue? Uh, this checking desk can't be found uh, by its baggage bag. Oh, yeah, because we haven't connected them up underground. Uh, where it happens over here, which goes down another level, doesn't it? Ha ha! See? I told you guys, I hate doing baggage. <laughs> uh, but it's kind of set up here with the tilt tray. It is kind of like there. We've just got to get it all connected. Right. So back in then, oh, we got to, we got to sort all this out as well, the, the claiming stuff. Um, okay, okay, okay. So baggage destroyer. No, I need the, the baggage scanner first. So that is two away. One there. One there. Wait, are they trying to land planes now already? No, because it's not connected to a boarding desk. I was going to say for a second there. You don't want to be doing that, boys. You don't want to be doing that. Um, boom. This one's on this side, right? It is. But that's not there. <laughs> Alright, that goes there. Well, I think it's all now going to be right. Uh, how many times have I click on you? That's them there, sorted. So then we'll do some high speeders. Straight in. Straight in. And then we want some high speed going... Oh, what have I done? There we go, going up. Do the first one. There. The second one. 
goes there. All right, just so we got the idea where we're going, boys. Just so we got the idea where we're going. So this one, there. The next one, there. All right, there we go. Okay, so we got the idea where they're now heading to. I then make them go down another level, don't I? Right. So that all connects into there. So this is the one that brings it all in. I think I get the other one to go kind of around in a way. But it will make it easier for me first if I get these going down as well. So going up, should I say. And then do the same on this side. I hate doing baggage, man. I really do. Alright, there. And there. <sighs> I think I'm there, guys. I think I'm there. So, okay. So, the one that sticks out the furthest on both sides is the one that brings the baggage in. Okay? Okay. Okay, guys. <laughs> right, so high speed again. There we go. So that would obviously ultimately come down this way, where we can make it go in. And it needs to stick out here. So I would need, like another, say, like another tilt tray there. Well, eventually I'm going to need one here as well. So I might as well get the room for the extra ones in. So that way, and that way. This would go all the way down here. And go into there. Right, this. Would come out to here. Wait, that's going the wrong way, isn't it? Yeah, I've just realized what's going on with that one. Because that one's bringing the baggage out. So when you think of it, you can't. I can't have the same system that I've just done. Oh, this is so complicated. Right, I've got to delete you. And delete you. Delete you and delete you. Isn't it annoying when you gotta work in both directions? It's a pain in the property. Right. So it's going up, but in the opposite direction. Okay, so going down. It's going up that way. Down. No, it's not, Sediac! I've done it again. Stop. Stop right now. Calm down. It's going down, fool. Down. Down. And I might have to just kind of slightly change the angles of those. Right, let's try this one again. I've finally got the hang of it. Right, down. And down. And that's connected up. So, please stop playing games with me like this. I don't know who you think you are right now. But it's just this is now facing the wrong way around. So I'm just going to quickly just delete this and then replace it. So all the rest should be okay. I just now need to connect this going up. It's long-winded and there is a better system for me to do this. But I'm just going to do it like this for now. At least at the end of the day they're high speed ones. So that's always a good thing. So I, I could just make it go this way and then connect up there, which is a short distance. I've chosen to make it go the long way around, but it is what it is. It is what it is. And then that should then technically be connected. We just wait for them to finish that up. God, it's so painful, isn't it, man? Trying to get the baggage up and running. Right. Oh, they've added 1,220. Damn, that's a lot of, that's a lot, a lot of customers. Right, the traveler shop. 
we'll get this done as well so employees can't find their job sites which is understandable because i don't even have anything set up right now i don't know how you can't find your job site boy it's plenty of jobs <laughs> Right, okay. It's down here I'm looking at, isn't it? Yeah. So how far have we got them, boys? That's all done. Okay, we're, we're back up and running here. So, yeah. To there, to there, to there. It all goes in that direction. Out, out, out. Sweet. Still got little bits and bobs that need to get in, but ultimately, it's all there. It's all freaking there at the moment. Um, okay, then. So we might need to hire a few extra... Right, staff, applicants, ramp agents. I'll hire a couple extra now. I'm going to get a couple of extra security officers. Just because they're there. And I think that'll be it. Because there's a few little issues over here. I don't know if that's like directed to what was going down then. But hopefully it's now taken care of. So I'm thinking then we can now connect with the boarding desks. So if I do this one first then, connect to stand, that is now all good to go. It's allowing medium aircraft on large stand. Do these runways allow medium aircraft? No, we'll allow both of them do medium aircraft. So at least we can schedule that then, which would be... What stand's that going to be? Don't tell me they've already scheduled. They can't have done. Already started to schedule flights. Get it all connected up then. Boom, boom, boom. God damn, there's so many. <laughs> God damn, there's so many boys. But uh, I think they have, well, yeah, they have. Cause it's all these ones up here. Pretty much. So that kind of throws all them in then. So, yeah, they've already got. Their planes already pre-scheduled and sorted. Because I ain't got to do nothing. Because a lot of planes are now coming in out of the airport. There's not a lot I need to do right now. Which, um... Might need, actually, to be honest with you, more passenger service agents. That could be a little bit crazy. Yeah, there's already baggage over here. Oh, might need more baggage vehicles. Let me go operations. Requires... Wait, what does? Oh, did I try and turn that on? Somehow. I might need more baggage trucks. I've got 14. All right, economy, procurement. Bout loaders. Two, four, six, eight. Get eight more of them. Uh, large. Okay, we get eight more of these. I'm just going to get a couple more of these. Jet A1 fuel. Get eight of them. Oh, is that the right one? A1 fuel. It's the wrong one, isn't it? I needed these ones. Um, fuel trailers. Let's get a couple extra fuel trailers. Pushback trucks. We need those. That's the Avgas. Why am I getting Avgas? Oh, I've now got a load of vehicles I need to get rid of. God damn it, Seniac. Right, belt loaders. Get a couple more of those. Get a couple more service cars for the ramp agents. A couple more stair trucks. A couple more catering vehicles. A couple more pushback trucks. There we go. Right, so a lot of stuff I've now just ordered. And I'm going to have to get rid of some of them fuel trucks and trailers if I order the wrong ones. We'll get rid of them anyway. But here's my first airplane landing for over here. A load of new products are arriving, so all these new vehicles will make their way in slowly but surely. Which would be good for us. And that kind of opens up this whole brand new section. Which is nice. And where's this aircraft going down here? 
I've still got put plenty of time and effort into sorting it all out. But they want refueling, they want catering and all that kind of jazz. Which is pretty good. Is that a, me is that a medium plane, by the way? I'm trying to slip the air the airplane. Um, I think it is. I think that is is that a medium plane? I can't quite remember if it is or not. But the stuff is all there anyway. I mean, pretty much up and running. So with the amount of money that we spent, maybe at some point we can watch and see if we turn in a profit. But I, you would assume that we're going to be making even more money right now with the with like two, four extra stands basically. It's a couple of hundred extra people coming in. A lot of people shopping right now. Grabbing food as well, which is all good. So it's all pointing in the right direction, if you think about it. We're slowly getting there. The baggage claim area... Oh, we haven't even set these baggage claim areas up, have we, to be honest with you? So baggage claim area. We do it like this, don't we? And we do it in a way where we connect this one... That one can be connected to this one. This one can be connected to this one. So, yeah, they can claim their baggage back. Which is perfect. That's all up and running. So that's why these planes are not requesting unloading. Like up here, see, not requested. Because you don't have any of that set up. Well, I think next episode we got to look at the maintenance. And we got to look at the cleaning too. Because that's another way to get extra money out of the planes. And I might need to do like an underground tunnel system up here as well to utilize because they're using a lot of this up here. See the traffic back and forward. But there's two entry points there. I need to open it up and make it a little bit wider. So I might need to do a road going further down too. Which is all good. You don't really mind that kind of stuff. Considering that the previous day we made this and already on this day with an hour to go we've made an extra 200,000 almost. Well it's 120,000 that we've made. Not an extra 200,000. Uh, but Again, when more days come, when we got like four days of the, the new four stands loading planes all day, that'll be free 400,000 extra, which would be pretty jazzy. But we need additional tunnels going under too. But it's all point in the right direction, guys, anyway. Hope you did enjoy this episode. If you did, smash that like button down below. And until next time, I'll see you all soon. So, good. Bye. <laughs>